just by knowing these two things, I became a better basketball player. This is because basketball is a mental game. So you can dominate others just by knowing something that they don't. Number one, practice does not make perfect. It only makes consistency. When I used to practice, I would practice for perfection, not a consistent shot. And when you start to practice for perfection in your mind, you'll only accept 10 out of 10, 20 out of 20. Once you start missing, it kind of breaks down your confidence. So until I started to look at NBA players and their three point percentage or field goal percentage, my outlook changed. For example, let's look at Stephen Curry. Uh, he's known for his three point shot. He's known for making his shots. 2019 to the 2020 NBA season, he made 40% of his shots. So if you're not Stephen Curry, I do not expect you to make 40% or more of your shots. Don't put yourself down if you miss. It's a part of the game. Now I'm not saying don't try to make every shot you shoot because you should put your best into every shot. But when you do miss, don't be scared to shoot again because the best miss. Number two, it kind of goes hand in hand with number one, confidence. To be a great basketball player, you need confidence. Don't just take my word for it though. Here's a quote that I found from Kevin Durant on confidence. He said, get excited about messing up because you know that you can learn from those mistakes quicker. It's just all about being confident in yourself and knowing it's gonna take some time for you to get where you wanna get to. But enjoy the process, as everybody says nowadays. Personally, it's hard to get excited about missing a shot, especially because I'm someone who wants my game to be flawless. But then yet again, we remember that NBA players, their games are not flawless, so why should ours? So please remember, practice does not make perfection, and be confident in yourself even when you miss because when you start losing that confidence, you'll start missing more shots. Knowing these two things made me a better basketball player. It helped me understand the game more. And I hope it does the same for you that it did for me. Thanks for watching and making it to the end of the video. Uh, consider subscribing. If you want to see more videos like this, click right here. Or if you want to see some of my other videos, click right here. Peace out.